morning everybody out there at least it's our morning we are getting on the road and I think we are detouring from the highway that's probably Audrey no. calling us there looks to be oh no, I didn't hear you what a wreck down there I I already did I I was trying to point to you but um yeah, we'll just go up here and turn around. Oh, no, Aja took the wrong turn. Okay. Um, there's, looks to be a wreck down on the highway. Somebody has told us that a semi has yeah. rolled. Yeah. So it might take us a little bit to get down the highway, but we are heading to Conway, I believe. Conway, where are we at? What state are we in? in Arkansas. <laughs> Arkansas. All right, uh, this is really a hub for uh, the truckers to pull over here. I've never seen so many truckers <laughs> in one area. They were pulled over on the side of the highways and you can see they're just packed up in here.
So, <laughs> she's filling out the card. We're all walking down to pay for the site. The ranger's assistant had a question about two rigs being in one site, but we explained to him that the other sites down here, as they are beautiful, they're on a cliff and there's no way, well, I wouldn't say a cliff. They're at such a bad angle, there's no way to be comfortable, period, in the rigs. Um, so through a, a little bit of talk and everything, they said, yep, you guys can go ahead and stay two rigs into the one campground. They even allowed us to pay for one campsite, which is kind of cool. We had no problem paying for two, but that works. This place is really full. And uh, you know what campsite number we are? What? We don't know. We don't know what campsite number we are. I'm not walking back there. Maybe they have a thing up here that says loop and we'll guess. Because we're on the last part of whatever that loop is. You know Oops. Yeah, we'll figure it out. We don't know. <laughs> We're having issues. <laughs> they got to have a map. Are you going all the way back to find out? What's today's date? The 15th. I said we could 16th. Ask, we could ask, look at the map and ask them. Yeah. They can, they'll know. We have our driver's li or our license plate on. And the other gentleman, we could go talk to him yeah. that helped us early. Jimmy, he can uh, tell us what date it is. <laughs> We don't know the date. And that is a tiny little thing. Uh, I could tow that behind our truck, hon, and we can live in that. Okay. It's big enough. It's bigger than our camper. Oh, we need a new and here's Terry with her picker upper and a garbage bag since we're walking this way. Okay. <laughs> She acted like it was a fire poker. I stuck it in the fire the other night because I had a piece of paper and I picked the paper up and I put it in the fire and then I went to move a log and I, yeah, these are not fire log movers. Oh, they're so $3.95. Now, now it makes it a little hard to close that darn thing. Oh, we just need to heat it back up and modify. This is a beautiful park though. I'll Absolutely, you. yeah, beautiful park. And I think every campsite has power. There's a, um, water is a different thing. They kind of have like outlets where you could go and like hook up, I guess, and fill your tank up. But it is absolutely beautiful. And here's the dump station. And for those yeah. that, um, and those that are worried about me not wearing gloves when I'm picking up trash, if we're picking up trash, like with our hands, yeah, I put gloves on. But I always just hang on to this. Roll. Oh. Roll, show oh, that's what you roll, got already. Yep. Roll that up and then I always use this to pick it up. So. Uh oh, we lucked out because this boy. Uh oh, look at this rig. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. They said that this place started filling up at 8 o'clock, that it was pretty much empty. And we left early. We left this morning at 9 o'clock um, and got here at 1 o'clock. And we should have been a little faster on our game, but we also traveled 116 miles to get here. So that gentleman there is Jimmy. He's the one that's helped us out and everything. And uh, they're now telling this gentleman he probably is not going to find any place. But what a truck. Holy moly. Just beautiful. But you got to be here early, I guess. All right, so there is all the information right there. Yeah, and this poor guy is just not going to find a spot. That is just terrible, terrible. <laughs> they are, but they're full. And here's the rules and regulations. Boy. I, can't, I don't know. <laughs> There's just too much there. Yeah, but it's like hunting, sanitation, abandonment. It's all of the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers rules. So what you need to do is bring a 12-year-old so they can read it and uh, 
tell you what it says because I can't see anything. I and don't I, even know if I could read that with my glasses. I don't know either. Right. But here's the lake. And uh, I don't think it says where we're at. You couldn't see it anyway. <laughs> no, I only have my sunglasses. And make sure you wear Oh yeah, it. why? Wear life jack jackets. <laughs> What did you just call it? Swimming. Life, 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 life jackets. Yep. So here's the um, table of contents here. It says, um, oh, she has good eyes. Policy, vehicle, vessels, aircraft, swimming, uh, picnicking, camping, hunting, fishing, and trapping is uh, section 32. Wait, no, sorry, 327B. Um, sanitation, fires, control of animals. Oh, I need to read that. Um, restrictions, explosive, firearms. You need to read that, Scotty. Oh. <laughs> or other weapons and fireworks. <laughs> well, what now my concern is, did we park our aircrafts properly? <laughs> did we? Why do they say aircraft? What are we Well, because you can land on the lake and... Oh, can you? Yes, oh, I would wow. assume so. And you probably could park at the marina. Let's, so better, here's a here's, jet. Yeah, I better read. Where's the public property? Hunting and fishing and trapping. Hunting is permitted except in areas and during periods where prohibited by the district commander. Ooh, they have a commander. Yes, sir. Absolutely. They got water here and another hose I guess you could hook up. Would not. Uh, yeah, it says drinking water only. I would not use that for drinking water. Um, period this one I assume does not come on oh so you use this one over here which is cool they have a flush out so when we go to leave I'll hook this old hose up and really do a, a cleaning ten bucks for non campers but to stay one night it's gonna cost you sixteen dollars and that gives you full power so why would you just come here for ten bucks this is a beautiful place and quite the bargain so Anyways, we're walking back to the camper, and I'm going to take a shower in a little bit. They got showers up there, and it's muggy. We're moving on. All right. Hope you enjoyed the little walk through the park. We might do another little walk about later on when it cools down. Until then, be safe, be cool, and treat each other with respect. Later, everybody.